This week we win the ducking Desert Eagle Prince stream in battle scarred condition. Hey, it's an expensive skin, okay? To enter, just like, comment and subscribe and react to the posting on my Discord server, linked below. Thanks! CS2 skins and the community around it are beautiful. Most people within it are creating wonderful things like websites, companies, content, new skins, artworks and way more. The community of course only has a very limited power. As looking at the skins and the rules around them, Valve is our somewhat mysterious but also kinda retarded government. So it is not a surprise that CS2 and skins also have many bad actors. Most noticeable, cheaters and scammers. And there is a really good chance that you have encountered both or even do on a regular basis. Valve is sadly not helping with any of those at the moment. Valve anti-cheat is a joke and scammers, despite a few really good updates like the phone confirmation when adding a new API key, can still do pretty much whatever they want. And the best case for the victims is that they get the scammer banned before the scammed item gets tradable and can be resold. Which only happens in rare cases and does not really help the victim in the end. So if you have been into skins for a long time, there's a good chance that you have been scammed yourself, me included, some was just retardness, or at least you know a few people that have been scammed. So you might be able to understand how bad it feels, especially when it's your fault in the end. Thinking back to my video where I sent a caramel slaughter to the wrong guy. So those people that really had to go through a bad loss, we will surprise today and hopefully make really ducking happy. I posted on my Discord, which you should definitely join, especially for the giveaway, that I'm working on a video about scamming and if somebody has been scammed before and could answer some questions. And holy shit, I got many answers! What they don't know yet is that this video is me trading for profit and with that profit trying to get back the exact skins they have lost. Helping me with this video is SkinsMonkey.com. SkinsMonkey is an automated CSGO bot trading site. They offer a huge amount of skins to instantly trade to, 24-7 live chat support and a 35% bonus on every cash deposit. With our referral code NEON you can get a free up to $5 bonus on your first trade when exchanging items worth at least $100. So like you can see here, I've calculated a little bit and found this cool deal on SkinsMonkey. I also used my $5 bonus, I just selected these 5 items out of my inventory for these two gut knife safari meshes field tested. I even got some leftover balance on the side which I can use for my next trade. The two gut knives were on trade logs so I just saved them onto the side but some days later I could just withdraw them to my steam and as you can see here, I've got a really Really good upgrade and with my bonus code also a really good deal. So check out SkinsMonkey right now, link to the site with my bonus code is in the description. But how does this work? I will trade, buy and sell CS2 skins for profit like I always do. It is my job anyways. But just in this case, the money I am making is not going towards me and my ducking baking addiction but will 100% go to refunding the items those victims lost to some nasty scammers. As I also asked them which items they lost in the scam, this is pretty easy. Of course, I cannot refund everybody, but I suggest we just start with making as many people as possible happy. So, we start trading now, so it's time for another uh, nothing to refund items trading montage. So, we were able to raise over ducking $200, now I would say we start buying back the items for the victims. What I try to do is really get the exact items they lost, but even with help from CS Float from the database it wasn't possible to find those people or in some cases I found those items but I couldn't contact the new owners. So we have to try to buy similar items to the one they lost. So let's start! So, we have bought a lot of items and ended up with 212.90 in our balance 
to give to the poor. No, of course, to the people that got scammed. Sorry, this was a bad joke. I would say we go into our list. And sadly, as you can see here, these are the people I interviewed. Most of them, of course, lost a knife or even more skins that are worth over $2,000. And I would love to help people, but I cannot refund people for $2,000. So I would say we take the $200 we made from our trading and try to refund as many people as possible the items they have lost. So we see those here together with the last guy here. Some people I try to press out as much information as possible about what skins have you lost and some luckily really said yo it was a cut to 2015 blood tiger craft and something like that which is really cool but some just said yo i lost like the whole inventory i lost many play skins so i cannot refund the same skins they lost but i will try to use the money as best as possible to refund them with some nice playing skins and as we can look into the inventories we will most likely not see a lot thank you well for the 10 day we can see items change um but yeah we will see which items we can buy them that will most likely make them very happy so let's start with our first guy who only got scammed by two dollars fifty but these two items were pretty special with some stickers and so so let's see if we can find them or if we can't find them just recraft them uh, there was no orb Acheron, this guy lost, but there is a similar priced orb Warm God with the best position and non-scratched sticker on the scope. So I think you will be pretty happy with that. But I also found a ducking AK Elite bit with, so with another cool sticker. So I think he will enjoy that. One eternity later. So, I have bought all of the items. Let's see if it got delivered. Sadly, two people I wanted to send skins back, they just changed their ducking Discord name, so I couldn't find them. So, if this hit you, I'm really sorry. I tried, okay, why are you changing your Discord name? Okay, but for the rest, we want to contact them. And I think the best way to surprise them that we are basically giving them back the money they lost is by contacting them and trying to get, I mean, I mean, reactions are way cooler when you can hear those people. So um, let's text those people and say, yo, your, what should we say? Let's say, yo, may I ask you some follow up questions in a voice call? Of course, we are not asking them follow up questions. We are telling them, yo, um, I am basically giving you back your money. Do you want that? <laughs> I hope they want it, otherwise this video would be a big fail. And yeah, let's then, then see their reactions. So let's do that. And Mr. Editor, hop into the first call. Or we don't cut to the first call because four of the five people did not really fall for my trap of, yo, I want to ask you some follow-up questions. They said they are not free and they never called me back. I wanted to give them like a knife and they just didn't answer. <laughs> But of course, I just told them, yo, then I have to do it via text and explain what is going on. And they were ducking happy. The only guy that wanted to go into a private voice call with me was Mr. C++. And we did a voice call and he was ducking happy. But Discord has like an automatic protection, so voice calls cannot be recorded. So C++, I am very happy that you are happy. Discord, fuck you. <laughs> But still, look at the actions. I can't believe it. Like Mr. Alam said, oh my god, bro, that's awesome. Can't believe. Super cool idea. Mr. Dabet was ducking. Hey man, not, not to stress, but when is the trade ban over? He's really happy that I gifted him some gloves, but he also wants them now. <laughs> what does the duck mean? Hope it means something good. It means nothing and everything. It's a duck. It's the perfect answer. I think. I think the people were pretty happy. Where was the last guy? He didn't change his name. So I could, had, and it take, took me so long to find this dude again. I mean, this picture says it all, okay? <laughs> I got the trade links from everybody. So let's just send them all their skins, shall we? Except for Mr. <coughs> because the ducking guy that I bought the knife off didn't deliver. So And then I was trade banned, so I couldn't buy it. So he needs to wait one more week. Nice. Storage sent back. Retrieve items. There they are. These are all the skins that our victim sadly got scammed. 
Not only the skins, these Queen Jaguar gloves are even low float, so worth a little bit more than the skin they lost. And we even got the sticker craft spec. Look at this. $70 sticker, ducking, flusher, AK, really ducking nice. So let's get all of the skins out there and send them to their rightful owners. <laughs> Okay, what the fuck? I have blocked this dude? Why have I blocked him? <laughs> Why have I blocked him? Okay, please, editor, don't show that or censor this. Holy shit. <laughs> um, okay, let's unblock him. I don't know why I blocked him. I'm sorry, dude, but let's send him his skins back. So, Mr. Dabet, yeah, he, this guy bought gloves for his friend, which was really heartbreaking. And yeah, he just lost them by an impersonator. I would just say, let's send him, or in this case, I guess his friend, his ducking gloves. Then we have C++, a ducking major dude on my channel, on my streams especially. And yeah, he got ducking scammed. He sent me a ducking, he sent me his ducking cave up. <laughs> Uh, he got ducking scammed by a cash trader. So also the guy said, yo, I will pay you after. And he never paid him. So, and he lost his, this ducking blood tiger. It was minimal wear. Uh, and I was field tested, but we got it in minimal wear, of course. With the Titan Cato 2015 sticker and a lot of play skins. So I organized like a selection of play skins for him, which hopefully make him happy. Oh, he already has an M4. So $13 with his sticker, of course, way more. Hope he is happy with that. Next up, 79. Okay. Please censor the name, Mr. Editor. This is the guy that didn't want it to be in the video. <laughs> uh, yeah. He, Ducking, was approached by somebody saying, yeah, uh, I trade you like a skin for a Steam gift card. Of course, he never got a ducking um, Steam gift card. He lost a battle scarred M for Hyper Beast, so we just send it back to him. Guys, if somebody offers you a ducking Steam gift card, don't accept it. Even if it is a real Steam gift card, uh, it could be like scammed from a credit card, and also like Steam balance is not worth a lot. So please, please, please never do, nah, never do that, guys. Confirm on phone. Let's send these guys their items and also contact them on Steam. And yeah. Hopefully they are happy. If you enjoyed what I did, make sure to share this video. I would love to make a second episode and give back more scammed items through my passion, which is Counter-Strike trading. Of course, if you got scammed now and see this video and think you can like apply here, I'm sorry, like the moment I release this video, I cannot really ask for new people because they could just be fakes to get skins. Uh, so um, I'm sorry, I have to stay with the list I already have. <laughs> Yeah, don't forget to join the giveaway, my boys. I am Neon, and I'll see you guys, hopefully, in the next one.